My husband had an affair with a Martian. My conspiracy theorist husband feared UFOs coming. To save me and our son, he locked us in the damp basement. I was afraid for him. Dan was gone for two days. To save my beloved, I broke the door down. Leaving my son in safety, I went into the mysterious light. But the alien turned out to be Dan's lover. I chased her away while shameless Dan begged her to stay. You lied you were single. You're not getting a penny from me. The millionaire refused to sponsor Dan's space flight. Dan blamed me for blowing the deal, but I hurried to my son. The door was jammed, then I couldn't free him. He cried while I tried in vain to get him. The door wouldn't budge, and the sleaze bag offered me a deal. I'll open it if you give me all your savings. Dan only cared about money, so I bought my son's freedom. My boy got sick from being in the damp. Sit in the basement. You're the one who left him here alone. Dan locked me again, and I couldn't take care of my ill son. I heard his cries but couldn't get out. Dan reinforced the door. My phone had no service in the basement. I threw it outside so my emergency message went through. It worked! Once they freed me, I rushed to find my son. But he was gone! You left your son alone in the basement, and he got seriously sick. While your husband was caring for the boy, you were hiding from justice. They believed Dan's lies and took away my parental rights. When I went to the hospital, Dan wouldn't let me see my boy. You're an awful mom. He got terminally ill on your watch. Treatment is so expensive. I won't make that if I work my whole life. This awful woman nearly killed my son. My husband slandered me on TV, but I could live with that. He was raising funds for our son's treatment. I could visit my boy in the hospital only in secret. I won't let you near him. You almost killed him. While pushing me away, Dan dropped his phone. From his chat, I found out he didn't care if the boy lived or died. My crazy husband was raising money for a tourist trip to space. But I promised my son I'd save him no matter the cost. Someone anonymously paid for the surgery in full. You'll be healthy. My son's surgery was a success. Meanwhile, Dan was furious. The money was gone. He got robbed and was looking for the thief on security footage. It showed me taking the money. I knew my son's life would cost me my freedom. Not only is she a bad mother, she's a thief. Arrest her. Accusing me, Dan got arrested himself. The police found out he planned to misuse the funds. It wasn't stealing. I spent the money exactly on what it was raised for. My son and I were together again. We found the lamp Dan used to scare us with UFOs. To get over the phobia, we painted cute pictures on it. The thing we used to fear became my son's favorite nightlight. <laughs>